Hello, everyone. Welcome to Contingencies of Care. My name is Ashok Mathur. I'm the Dean of Graduate Studies at OCAD University. Uh, and this uh, is our lovely organizing team. And uh, we'll all just say a few words to you, and uh, then we'll get going with this residency. Uh, this came about because many of us were thinking about how we could accommodate grad students' needs around uh, uh, working on residencies and placements and, and such many of which have been canceled due to the pandemic. So we struck on this idea, and thanks to many of the people that you see here, we came up with this concept of what we do around notions of care. And so that is how this came into being. So welcome all, and I'm gonna turn it over to the rest of the team to introduce themselves. Okay, why? hi everyone. Uh, welcome to uh, this residency. I'm Tanya Willard. I work with Bush Gallery uh, and also with uh, UBC Okanagan, where I'm assistant professor teaching in visual arts. And I'm happy to be here and share in this residency that focuses and centers ideas and concepts and work around care and caring. It's something that's uh, impacted my work in terms of caretaking for my children, caring for my land as a Sopatmukh citizen, uh, and working with ideas about how can we slow down, how can we spend time caring. And that's, of course, also a really important uh, part of this time we're in right now is caring for each other. So we have this amazing team, we have amazing artist facilitators and all of you uh, who are bringing all of your amazing practices and I think we'll be building a lot of amazing care networks through this. So Cook's Gem, thank you. Hi everyone, I'm Steve Lamb. I'm the Associate Vice President of Research and Dean of Graduate Studies at Emily Carr University. Um, so thrilled that you all are convening in this, in this context. Um, it's a troubling and, and, and disturbing time. So um, identifying ways to build new, so new solidarities, new gestures of convening together. Um, even more amazing that um, the, um, there's all of these institutions that are, are interconnecting and thinking about ways to model different types of agency and, and model different types of being is, is really um, inspiring. So we hope that you have a, a great opportunity to sort of meet others, um, like-minded individuals, but also think about um, how new ideas of praxis, how care can be a, a, a type of, of um, um, being together. Hi everyone, I'm Andrea Fatona and I am the Grad Program Director of the Criticism and Curatorial Program at OCAD U. I'm also a practicing curator. I'm so excited to be part of this project and uh, really hope that you will also be as excited as I am. I'm really excited for us to be together to um, imagine and bring in to be new ways of caring for each other, but also caring for those environments and ecologies that we find ourselves in. And I am a strong believer that if we can imagine it together, we can bring it into being. So for me, this is really about trying to come up with new ways so that our present and our future can look the ways we want it to be. So welcome. Uh, hi folks. Uh, Zekta Anya, in Sini Flagohin, Tluachan Tatla, Nanda, and um, Edu Didenek Hodeses. My name is Peter Morin, and I am uh, from the Crow Clan of the Taltan Nation of Telegraph Creek, BC, and I am a professor with the Faculty of Arts at OCAD. Um, performance artist and I make stuff um, and I get to hang out with these amazing people uh, chatting about this residency but also um, figuring out stronger um, powerful potent ways to reach beyond the screen to reach beyond um, how how we are living right now um, and also like uh, conversations, deep conversations about um, how do we do this better? How do we see each other better? How do we recognize that uh, our community, communities uh, that we, we are a part of are suffering um, right, right now, but also beyond right now? Um, how do we meet each other with, with um, kindness? Um, 
it's moments like this that I'm, I'm just so excited because not only do I get to listen to and learn from the folks in this room, but also the folks who are coming to these to this virtual residency, and, and um, how how strong we all are, and how we can how we can, uh, like Andrea is saying, we can imagine and we can do better. Madu sugasen la madu. Hi, Bojo, Nisoe Gamikwe and Dishnakas, Wapshashi Dodem. Um, Jimna Singh Ndonjaba, Port Severin Ndonjaba. Um, my name is Lisa Myers and um, I am a member of Beausoleil First Nation <clears throat> or Jimna Singh and um, I'm really excited to be here uh, for this um, this residency, this virtual residency and to see the unfolding and the, all the preparations that have gone on to make this possible. Um, such a huge team have brought all of these different platforms together to figure out ways for us to be able to connect um, in our distance. And, and I think this is really special. And um, so I, I'm really looking forward to learning a lot. I'm a professor, assistant professor at um, York University in environmental studies. I teach art in environmental studies and I teach courses around food. Um, and uh, I guess part of what I'm excited about too is thinking about how <clears throat> gardens and food, um, how we can connect between, uh, through discussions around that and how that connects us um, and sort of highlights our relationships with, uh, I guess, lack of better word, non-human. Um, uh, the non-human beings that are around us, us as well as um, kind of staying with the trouble of what happens for us and uh, the environment and and how can we um, kind of take care of all of those things and take care of even the troubles um, that are that are occurring and um, yeah I think there's a lot to uh, I, I'm just looking forward to connecting with lots of people and and um, talking more about all of these ideas and I say I'm really honored to be invited um, and to be here with everybody on this organizing committee and the residency overall so miigwech and uh, hope to talk to you across paths in the next couple of weeks hi my name is Myung Sun I'm an uh, I'm an artist and uh, based in Toronto. I'm also the associate curator in, of public programming at the Toronto Biennial of Art. Uh, I'm really excited to be part of this residency. Um, the, all the conversations that leading up to this point has been incredibly generative. And um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to learning a lot more from everyone. Um, I'm, I was blown away by what the students already have uh, built for this residency and um, look forward to meeting all of you. Yeah, and learning from you. Thanks. Hi everyone. My name is Candace Hopkins. I'm also one of your hosts and a curator with the Toronto Biennial of Art. Um, I'm grateful to be here to be able to hold space with all of you to as Peter already said, to find ways to think and work together beyond this screen. Um, I'm also grateful for the time that this gives us to think together, to work together in this pause, also to create non-work together, <laughs> how we can hold space in the virtual as a kind of residency and what that means. Um, and how this space might only not, on, not only teach us ways to care from, for one another in a time when we often can't be together physically, but also how those modes of care might transfer to our own work as many of us negotiate these spaces between ourselves, either as artists or writers or curators or administrators in the institution. Um, so very much looking forward to learning alongside all of you and from you as well. Thank you for joining us and welcome. Thanks all, thanks to this amazing team. Um, we have over a hundred people involved in this residence as grad students and also as uh, visiting artists. And I wanna find, uh, put out a final shout out to uh, uh, an incredible uh, set of teams we had working as research assistants at OCAD, uh, working on developing this platform and also uh, providing content. So big shout out to, to all of you, all 15 of you, and to everyone else involved. Look forward to seeing you over the next two weeks. We'll see you soon.